Tango X-ray, contact tower now on 126.0. Hi, it's Robert Goyer at AirVenture 2010 with Cirrus Aircraft VP of Marketing Todd Simmons. Now this year Cirrus had a really interesting introduction. It's ESP, it's a stability augmentation device that will help pilots recover control of the aircraft if things go wrong. Can you tell right. us some more about it, Todd? Well, Robert, thanks uh, for being here today and thanks for asking. And indeed, we did announce to, uh, this week, in fact it was Sunday night, we were so excited about it. As you said, we call it Perspective Electronic Stability and Protection. We're obviously sitting in front of the Cirrus Perspective cockpit by Garmin. So it's designed to integrate with the Perspective cockpit. Absolutely, very integrated into this. And ultimately, or fundamentally if you will, this is a safety system that is always working in the background. It does use the GFC 700 autopilot. Does the autopilot have to be on when you're using it? That's a great point, Robert. The autopilot does not have to be on. And that, that is the same as saying it's always there in the background. We, we've got this sort of catchphrase, if you will, that you'll never fly a single pilot again. You've got a system that is vigilant in the background and really helping you recognize the onset of loss of control, the number one cause of accidents today in general aviation aircraft. Yeah, and I know from studying the accident reports that a lot of times loss of control is something that pilots only recognize is happening after it's too late to do anything about it. This is kind of like a helping hand being there to wait for you when you need the help. What about when you don't need the help? I mean, is it gonna be uh, changing the way that you fly? It's not, and that's the interesting thing. It's always there in the background, and quite frankly, it really begins to kick in when we really get in what we would ordinarily consider an extreme situation, but, but would help with just those extra few seconds to not ever get into, again, that loss of control. And that loss of control is so key because it's so rare, pilots aren't ready to know what to do. So if we can give ourselves a little bit more time, like this does, but in the background, it's never going to affect your flying and normal flying activity. So it would really answer a lot of the objections that pilots would have right. to it, feeling that it's going to somehow make them less of a pilot. They're still hand flying the airplane, except in that rare instance when they need the help. Absolutely, and no less of a pilot than really conceptually that the parachute's on board. We, we never think of you know needing insurance, if you will. The parachute certainly fits that. We certainly hope we never see a pull again. That means we're all flying much safer, but it's there if you need it. And we can look at really the Cirrus multi-layered approach to safety, the parachute, uh, the airframe, the way it's constructed with the roll cage, the way we've laid this out, the blue level button. Right. Now we've added in that one additional feature in the background that says, can I get a little bit more time? Can it help me see something happening that's very much out of the ordinary? And again, multi-layered approach to safety. We think it's important as the parachute. And it's just a different way too. Perhaps right. it'll keep you from having to ever pull that chute. <laughs> That's exactly right. Um, you get more and more options as you go to, for, to let either the airplane or for the airplane to alert the pilot something's not going right and make another decision to not get further down that critical decision chain we always talk about where, where the accident's coming towards you. Right, so what's the availability on this? When, when can pilots get it in their 22s and 20s? And how much is it gonna cost? 22s and 20s, and I've got good news on all points. We're sort of in the final stages of certification right now. Of course, Garmin announced an ESP product that's gonna be available on King Air for $18,000. And I'm here to tell you today that for people that order right now, we will make the software upgrade, and that's all it is, a software oh, upgrade as of September at no charge. I had no charge. So well, we think that's a price that you important. can't beat. <laughs> that's a price you can't beat. It's a, it's a fantastic system. And again, I think we're going to see over time, as people begin to recognize what it does, we'll see people recognizing how critical it is, even though it's one of those things that's difficult to see, if you will.